So one of the best things you can do when you are trying to create top selling products on Etsy is to combine two things. That is a person with a specific season and specifically we want to focus on teachers for the fall season. And there are a ton of different products you can start creating and selling that can gain you sales today. So in today's video, I want to share with you a very easy design. You can start selling right now on Etsy, but also the key words you need to start utilizing for these designs in order to drive the right traffic to your shop. I'm going to share with you what product is selling well, what keywords to use, and even how to design this product so you can start gaining sales today i want to share this all with you coming up next Now, one of the top areas that we're talking about today is combining two type of things here. It is the teacher niche along with a specific season like Thanksgiving. And as you can see here, there are a ton of different products that are doing well. These things have popular now badges. Some of them have bestsellers badges. And these things are only going to increase as time go on. But one specific thing we definitely want to focus on is what is the sales volume, right? What are they doing in regards to sales and what keywords they are using? This is going to help us better decide what type of products we need to focus on and even learn from these top selling designs where we can start incorporating into our own design space. Now, one of the main tools that we're going to use today to help us better understand what type of products we need to sell is the tool Everbee. This is a great tool if you want to dig deeper in regards to what is selling well, the actual sales data, understanding the keywords that's being utilized for these designs here. All this data and information is extremely helpful, and you can see this in real time and gives you a better understanding of what type of products you need to design but more specifically what type of keywords you need to use in these designs now if you want to check out everbee on your own you can get started absolutely for free in today's video we'll be using some of the pro features but you can definitely get started today testing this out absolutely for free I'll make sure to leave all the details down in my description box below if you want to try this out on your own and to see if this is best for your Etsy business all right, so here is a trending product that we have found to do extremely well here, and it is focused on the teacher niche. And as you can see, it is taken upon these popular phrases we talked about in our previous video, where we know that we can actually scale our Etsy shop to make massive sales if we're focusing on these popular phrases. But one of the things we definitely want to focus on is combining these popular phrases with seasons and bringing in some unique design styles into our areas. We know that when we are doing trend research, we not only want to find what is working, but also so add in some things that can bring a new variable into the marketplace that we can start selling a different variation of this product and even move this to a different type of category focusing on things that are selling well but understanding from the data how well they have been selling and what are some things we can incorporate into our design so with the help of everbee we can see some data here on the top which is extremely helpful especially if we are trying to integrate these things over into our design space we can see this product has sold 11 times in the last 30 days has received 171 sales in a lifetime of a listing but i'm more so looking at this number here the view count as this is tied to just not the design itself but also the keywords and one helpful area that we are going to learn also with these designs is that whatever the, the design is it needs to match up with what the key phrase is i have this blocked out just to give some privacy to the title but if we open up this a little bit further we can scroll down and see some additional things this specific listing is using for their keywords for their titles for their tags and as a side note whatever they have in their tags is probably going to be found in their title as well but as we can see here they're utilizing all of these specific key phrases that's tied to what this product is again pumpkin shirt we can see this uh, cute t-shirt for teachers we can go down and say pumpkin patch shirt fall teacher shirt so we need to make sure that whatever our design is it needs to match up with what the keyword is and so we definitely want to focus on this design space obviously it's proven to work out extremely well here the sales are high again we know this is just going to increase the more we get to the peak of the season so with that being said we want to redesign this in a way that we can start gaining sales as well again we're not trying to make a carbon copy of what's here but definitely create a version of this adding some unique things to our design to make it stand out even more and truly provide a new variable in the marketplace where we can sell these type of designs 
Now, when I do find these keywords over here, one of the helpful things I can do as well is copy this entire list of keywords. I definitely want to hold these keywords because obviously these keywords are driving in views, driving in traffic. And this is how you're able to save so much time in regards to keyword research and design research because you know these keywords are obviously driving sales. We can see this with the volume that's being done with the searches. We can see the level of competition here. Again, these are the keywords that's driving in the specific traffic. So we definitely want to create multiple products around this niche and utilize these type of keywords for our product as well. And the easy thing would ever be that we can simply click this button here where we can copy the entire listing keyword for our products that we create. All right, so the program that we're going to use to help us design this software is going to be Kittle. And the reason for that is that they have a really easy to use AI system because we definitely want to redesign that key element that we're going to create for this teacher fall design t-shirt. So from here, I like to head over to new design here or new projects. And with this new projects, I want to focus on a t-shirt POD presets. I head all the way down to the specific print provider I'm printing for. In that case, it is Printify, which is going to be perfect when we are creating this product here. With that being said, I head over to this size and I'll scroll all the way down to the bottom to just go ahead and start my project and I have create now. And now I have my canvas at the perfect size for me to really create my product properly for me to utilize those AI designs and definitely that key phrase for my next project. So I can head over to the right hand side and utilize their AI tool for me to put in a prompt here and to generate a prompt that will create the element I want to use for my product. So here are some example products. Again, these could be used as we're talking about today for t-shirts, but these can definitely be transferable over into different type of products. As we said, whatever is working well with one category, like in our case today, we talked about these fall type of t-shirts. These things can easily be integrated over into different products, either be physical products or digital products like digital tumblerites, which I teach on my channel all the time. But as you can see here, we utilize some unique AI prompts to get these type of trending pumpkin designs. As you can see here, just creating a new element can allow your product to stand out well above what's already visible on the Etsy marketplace. The overall goal here is that we want to add a new variation to this entire line of products that we can incorporate something new, but still stay within the bounds of things that will work. And if you do want to check out the actual prompt I use to create this type of design, then check out my description box below. I'll give you the prompt right there that you can start utilizing yourself and whatever AI tool that you're using for your designs. Now, here's a quick example of how this product will look once it is printed out on a T-shirt. Again, I think this is extremely well, even if I want to see how this will look on a real mock-up person or real mock-up photo. And I think that came out well also. And again, the overall goal here is not to copy what's already here, but definitely utilize those popular phrases, those popular themes, even getting down to the season itself and start creating new things that we can start utilizing on our Etsy shop. And I think this came out extremely well. And as stated before, if we do want to utilize this design for a different type of product, we can definitely utilize this for the Tumblr wraps as well. And as you can see, we can definitely transfer this design into other products that we can start selling on our Etsy shop as as well and if i do want to add in a new variable for these designs i can simply add in some personalization to make this product stand out even more and that is probably one of the quickest ways for you to add value here for these designs if you see a lot of these products selling well but they're not offering that personalization definitely adding this to your design can help you sell extremely well and once you are able to grab a host of different type of seasonal teacher t-shirt phrases and even elements that are doing well you can create tons of different products utilizing those keywords we grab over from everby and start utilizing these on our t-shirt designs so as you can see finding these popular t-shirt phrases for teachers especially for the thanksgiving season is a great place for you to create and design especially when you have all of those keywords you can start utilizing on multiple products now if you're new to selling anything on etsy and you're not sure how to get started i have created a free etsy course where i share with you how to get started from start to finish setting up your etsy shop and listing your first product if you want that step-by-step -step starter course to help you get started yourself then simply type in the comment section below the word starter and i'll make sure i send you you personally in that link so you can get started in your Etsy shop today. Now, if you want to learn how to actually create designs like this, then check out this next video here where I teach you step by step how to create similar products like in today's video. As always, my friends, my name is Jay and I will see you in the next video.